Welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to get 99 in combat stats, attack, defense, and strength. Thank you. Hello. Alright, from, level from levels 1 to 10, we'll be killing chickens. What you need is full iron armor, amulet of strength, this can also be traded with fury if you're rich enough, a blade storm grape, it's pretty cheap in the GE, iron skimmer of course, as you cannot use any other skimmer, and you could also get berserk ring, which I have, but it's quite expensive, so you might want to get recoil, ring with recoil, and uh, you could trade the fury with amulet of glory, or amulet of strength, and you will be killing these from levels 1 to 10, it will not take very long, you can also pick up the feathers and sell them at GE, make some money. And uh, that's it. Uh, I'll show I'll, get, I'll show you another method. All right. Once you're uh, 10, 10 in all stats, you go. You come and ca kill some cows. They're really fast, easy. You can make money off the cow hides. Um, I I recommend it. It's pretty good. I like it because you can make money. And yeah, that's basically it. Upgrade to a black skimmy and upgrade your armor and all. Alright, next up is uh, I'll, I'll call it Warriors. Um, they, they hit quite hard because they all bunch up on you. So you gotta get some uh, nice defense armor. Um, and also get a combat bracelet and some climbing boots if you can do the death plateau quest Anyways, if you start fighting them, they all come and start killing you So yeah, just uh, watch out for that and bring some food Alright, at this point I recommend you get rune armor and a rune skimmer And yeah, and for this next part you'll need a brass key You can get one off the GE Alright, so you come to this little shed here, it's uh, west of the GE, climb down here, and you kill this monster, you guys probably know of it, it's called the Hill Giant. And the cool thing about Hill Giants, oh, I'm lagging, I'll show you, one second. The cool thing about Hill Giants is, you when you attack, they're aggressive if you're, um, under level 50 or 50 something, I, I can't remember exactly. And the cool thing about them is you can make tons of money if you're a low level player. Just pick up the big bones and sell them in the GE. And if you have 10 dungeon engineering, which is not very hard to get, you can come here to the resource dungeon. I'll show you right. Sorry for the light, guys. You go here. And there's many. Okay, if you're also level 40 and you're a member, you should consider getting Void. Void is very good. Void is almost the same as Bandos except for, for um, defense bonuses. And uh, what I mean by almost like Bandos is it gives 15% extra damage and I tried it out on the max hit calculator. But anyways, it's pretty good. You should, and the good thing about it is it's free. So if you're level 42 defense, you should consider getting it. It takes time though. Alright, if you're level 40, you should do this. Level 40 to 60. Train at Rock Crabs. There's not that many people here. But it's... Oh, sorry for the lag. It's... Um, it's a good place to train, you know, there's some people here you can chat to. And um, if you're also training range, you should, you should cannon these. You get a lot of range experience. Oh, spin ticket. <laughs> Anyways, alright, next, next level. See you later. Okay, now that you're level 50, or 60 depending on which way you took, uh, 50 or 60, you know, combat stats. Now, what you should do is consider getting the Dragon Skimmer. Uh, it requires Monkey Madness, which is, oh, trust me, that quest is horrible. I mean, it 
takes time. You know, he's on the other side. You could also get Dragon Boots, Dragon Defender, or you could also get Rune or um, Climbing Boots. You can stick with the Rune Skimmer, uh, although it won't be as fast XP. Alright, the next place is Flesh Crawlers. Flesh Crawlers are aggressive to all, and they're decent XP. They drop herbs if you um, if you want to make money here. See, a lot of good thing about these uh, these training places is you can make money. So yeah, basically that's it. They're, okay, so now after this we're gonna do from level seven from level sixty-five to ninety-nine. Alright, one second. Free to play. This is gonna be the road from six, level 65 to 99. It will be long and painful, so I, I really suggest getting members, but if not, you're gonna be killing. You're gonna be killing uh, giant spiders. Giant spiders are aggressive, they're decent XP, but member. Uh, Free to play have horrible XP rates. Just look what I'm hitting. This is just horrible. I recommend getting members. If not, keep training here. This is basically the only place you can train. Alright. Okay guys, I'm gonna show you how to kill bandits. All you need is like my inventory, you need some supersets, prayer potions, and a bandit teleport. Also, you could also get the Barox Helper for emergency. Alright. Oh, and you also need um, Zamrock Arrow or any other Zamrock or Cerodomen item. Alright. Go get one. Bandits are really good for XP, they provide 60k an hour. XP basically, so it's a good, better than average. All right, now we're gonna go to the bandit camp. All right, let's just build it. Let's go. Okay. Okay, what you need to do is just drink your super set first of all. All right, wait. I'm lagging. All right. You see these bandits? If you wear the uh, Zamrock or Cerodomen item, they automatically attack you, and you could just AFK them. And all you need to do is protect melee, or, or just uh, use any other prayer, basically. So yeah, that's all. Or you should stand here. This is basically the best play. Alright, next method is armored zombies, you should do this from 80 to 99. Bring void, salve amulet which hits extra 20% on undead monsters, void is 15%. Chaotic Reaper is the best, but if you can't get it, you could also use a whip. Um, use this setup, I'm doing two super sets without defense potions. And once you get to the armored zombies, just pray, pray melee, and if you get hit by the rangers, just eat. And you could go back and bank and Barak and come back. It's really simple. And you you always hit high on these. They have low defense. Um, they they're basically the best XP in the game. Mm, so yeah, here I'll show you a clip of me killing some. I'll pray on this altar. And it looks like I'm in the wilderness, but I'm I'm really not. It's just a fake wilderness.